Young people leaving care are marking an important milestone. Until recently, those leaving out-of-home care were cut off from support when they turned 18. Now all states and territories have plans to extend support until the age of 21. For Teresa, the last year has been a whirlwind. She left residential care, took her high school exams, got a job, rented a flat and earned a place at uni all on her own. She's 18 years old. There were just a lot of times where I felt really alone and I didn't know where to turn. She is one of 3,000 young people who leave care every year, moving out of foster homes or kinship care or, like Teresa, leaving residential care. While her friends could concentrate on exams, she was busy being an adult. They didn't need to go to a HSC exam and then come home and have a rental ins inspection, do the groceries, pay a bill and then study. Out of home care leavers often struggle with high levels of homelessness, unemployment and crime. But starting this month, young people like Teresa will get more support. All states and territories now have plans to provide caseworkers and allowances for teens leaving out of home care. Instead of being cut off at 18, they will get support until the age of 21. The fact that in every jurisdiction now we've got a housing allowance and we've got caseworker support is massively important. The Department of Social Services says it's reviewing a federally funded $1,500 allowance for those leaving out of home care. Teresa believes boosting that payment should just be the starting point. It really is an investment into their lives. She says there's still much to do to help young people like her avoid the pitfalls of being forced into adulthood as teenagers. Norman Hermont, ABC News.